హలో ఎవ్రీ వన్ వెల్కమ్ బ్యాక్ టు మై ఛానల్ ఐ ఎమ్ ప్రజ్వల్ ఫ్రమ్ శ్రీ వెంకటేశ్వర కాలేజ్ ఆఫ్ ఇంజనీరింగ్ సిక్స్ ఎమ్ ఐఎస్సి టుడే వీ గోన్ లర్న్ అబౌట్ ఫ్లాట్ ప్లేట్ కలెక్టర్స్ వాట్ ఈస్ అ ఫ్లాట్ ప్లేట్ కలెక్టర్ అ ఫ్లాట్ ప్లేట్ కలెక్టర్ ఈస్ అ సోలార్ ప్యానల్ డివైస్ దట్ యూజెస్ సోలార్ ఎనర్జీ టు జనరేట్ థర్మల్ ఎనర్జీ ఇట్ కన్వర్ట్ సోలార్ పవర్ ఇన్ టు థర్మల్ ఎనర్జీ దట్ ఈస్ చీపర్ ఎనర్జీ యూటిలైజేషన్ వాటర్ యాజ్ ఎన్ ఆపరేటింగ్ ఫ్లూయిడ్ Types of solar collectors, flat plate collectors, evacuated tube collectors, line focus collectors, point focus and parabolic dish collectors. Types of solar collectors, flat plate collector, flat plate collectors are, are the most simple and common type of solar collectors that anyone can see in their areas. These are basically metal box with a dark colored absorber plate and have transparent glazing cover on the top. Such plates are generally fabricated from a metal such as copper or aluminium which is a good conductor for better absorption and retention of heat. These absorber plates are sometimes painted with special coating other than the usual black paint. Here's a brief reference in regard to how these collectors work and what their components are. There is a glazing material used in flat plate collectors. The material is transparent and the solar radiation course down through this material in order to reach the absorbing plate. Once enough radiation hits the absorber plate, it does its job, heating the plate. The entire purpose behind generating and circulating the generated heat between the absorber plate and the glazing cover is to raise the temperature of the water or air that flowing between the plate and the cover. To diminish heat loss to other parts of the solar collector, the bottom and the sides of the device are covered with insulation. Evacuated Tube Collectors When talking about these solar collectors, you will find out that instead of one, there are entire fleet of tubes needed to raise the temperature of the water by hearing it. Such tubes use a evacuated space or vacuum to trap the energy from the sun. The main application of these tubes is to minimize heat loss. Here are the reference in regard to their components and their working. A metal tube plays the part of the absorber plate. The absorber plate is directly patched with heating pipe. The liquid that has to be heated flows inside the heating pipe. The job of the heating pipe is to show direction to the heat. so that it can raise the water's temperature. Easier said than done. It is not that simple to understand how the heat pipe allows the transfer of thermal energy from one point to another. But worry not, we have simplified things for you. There are naturally two ends in a heating pipe. One end opens at the side of the absorber plate. It's where the heat is generated. Since, hence, this is the point is known as the heat end. The second end opens at the side of the cool water that is supposed to be heated. This end is naturally known as cold end. At a certain pressure, the generated heat start flowing towards the cold end, eventually heating the cold water. Line focus collector, better known as parabolic thorough. The line focus solar collector uses the same principle for heating water or air that other collectors do. Collecting water, collecting heat on an observer plate and then transferring it to the water that sits to be heated. The collector here is rather effective parabolic shaped reflective material. The line focus collector are extremely powerful solar collector type. Therefore, they are used to produce steam for large solar thermal power plant and not for domestic purpose. There is a pipe in center of, of this throw that functions as a carrier of water. The sunlight gathered by the reflective material is focused into this central pipe which leads to heating of the water. The throw productively produces heat energy from the sunlight, specifically the pivot through which tracks the sun throughout the day for optimal trapping of the sunlight. Point focus 
और पैराबोलिक डिस्क कलेक्टर दिस पॉइंट फोकस कलेक्टर और ऑल्सो लार्ज पैराबोलिक शेप डिवाइस दैट आर फैब्रिकेटेड विथ हाईली रिफ्लेक्टिव मटेरियल दिस टाइप ऑफ सोलर कलेक्टर अगेन फॉलोज द सेम कॉन्सेप्ट एज द एज दट ऑफ अदर कलेक्टर्स दे डायरेक्टली फोकस ऑन कलेक्टिंग सोलर एनर्जी इन टू अ सिंगल पॉइंट दैट यूजली द ऑब्जर्वर प्लेट द हीट जनरेटेड इज सो सब्सटेनेबल दैट इट इज यूटिलाइज फॉर ऑपरेटिंग स्टेरिंग इंजिनस दिस पैराबोलिक डिशेस कैन वर्क एस अ इंडिपेंडेंट इंस्टॉलेशन फॉर एफिशियंट कलेक्शन दे कॉन्स्टेंटली ट्रैक द पोजिशन ऑफ सन दे कैन वेरी वेल बी यूज इन टैम्ड विथ कॉन्सेंट्रेटेड पी वी मॉड्यूल कंस्ट्रक्शन ऑफ फ्लैट प्लेट कलेक्टर इट टिपिकली कंसिस्ट ऑफ शैलो रेक्टेंगल बॉक्स विथ अ ग्लास और प्लास्टिक कवर ऑन द टॉप एंड ब्लैक ऑब्जर्वर प्लेट इन साइड ही आर आर द जनरल स्टेप्स इन्वॉल्व इन कंस्ट्रक्शन ऑफ फ्लैट प्लेट कलेक्टर डिजाइन ऑफ द कलेक्टर डिटर्माइन द साइज सेप एंड मटेरियल ऑफ द कलेक्टर बेस्ड ऑन द डिजाइर अप्लीकेशन एंड द अवेलेबल रिसोर्सेस बिल्ड द फेम कंस्ट्रक्ट अ ट्राइंगल फेम आउट ऑफ द एल्यूमिनियम और अदर लाइट वेट मटीरियल द फेम शुड बी स्लाइडली लार्जर दैन द अब्जर्वर प्लेट एंड शुड बी डेप्थ ऑफ अटलीस्ट टू इंच टू अलाउ द अलाउ फॉर इंस्टॉलेशन एड इंसुलेशन लाइन द बॉटम एंड साइड ऑफ द फेम विथ इंसुलेशन मटीरियल सच एस फाइबर ग्लास और रॉक वूल दिस विल हेल्प टू रेड्यूस हीट लॉस फ्रॉम द बैक ऑफ द अब्जर्वर प्लेट एड द ग्लेजिंग Cut the piece of temperature glass, tempered glass or plastic to fit over the top of the frame. The glazing should be at least one by eight inch thick to prevent breakage. Seal the edges of the glazing with weather stripping or silicone cloth to prevent air leaks. Install the inlet and outlet. Drill two hole in the frame near the bottom, one for the inlet and one for the outlet. Attach pipes or tubing to the hole using fittings. Test the collector. Place a collector in a sun location and connect the inlet and outlet pipe to the heat exchanger. Measure the temperature of the fluid as it flows through collector to determine efficiency. Here is the diagram for flat plate collector, inlet valve, outlet valve, glazing, absorber plate, insulation, flow tube, flow tube and header. working of flat plate collector the basic working principle of flat plate collector is as follows sunlight is absorbed by dark absorber plate which is designed to maximize the amount of solar energy absorbed while minimizing the amount of energy that is reflected as the absorber plate absorbs sunlight it heats up and transfers the heat to the heat transfer fluid flowing through the tubes or channels the heat fluid then flows to the heat exchanger where the heat is transfer to a storage tank or directly to the intended application such as space heating or hot water a pump may be used to circulate the heat transfer fluid through the system and the controller may be used to regulate the flow of temperature of the liquid the flat advantages of flat plate collector a flat plate collector facilitates the facilitates the collection of direct energy from all direction and diffuses thermal radiation it is clean pollution free system for energy generation the power utilization of fpc is natural and renewable flat plate collector devices have relatively low maintenance cost and longer working life it is easy to fabricate and economically it can be installed effortlessly flat plate collectors are fixed to a mounting structure in tilt and alternate orientation in which they receive maximum sunlight with flat plate collectors more energy can be generated even at low temperature what are the disadvantages of flat plate collector unstable performance and insufficient storage unlike other solar panel the performance of flat plate collector is very unstable affecting their energy output the performance of flat plate collector has been found to be affected by many factors like weather condition geographical location and locate local climate condition as a flat plate collector is only designed to produce a limited amount of thermal energy its storage capacity is also significant less than that of other solar thermal system due to this the electricity produced from the system can sometimes be less than electricity used by the system the flat plate collector storage facilitates to 
is also linked with higher temperature and is affected by low irradiance. This results in continuous loss of end of each day which is which makes it impossible for the system to recover even 50 to 60 percent of its produced energy. Applications for flat plate collectors. The flat plate collectors have been more and more popular over the world because of its simplicity, easy to installation and low cost. The flat plate collectors can also be used to heat ground water or other underground medium. It is also effective in using a as an evaporative cooler and humidifier by using an evaporator tube that can be connected to a tank of water with the water source such as rainwater. Many commercial buildings or homes use flat plate collectors in office space, restaurant, schools and apartment buildings for air conditioning or heat purpose by connecting them directly to the building's HVAC systems. They are also used in food processing plants where they can be used for drying, dry fruit, drying fruits and vegetables. The other common application for a flat plate collector are solar water heater. System are distinctly heating. The heating of air or liquid is in, in industrial process and solar space heating. Conclusion In conclusion, flat plate collector are one of the most common solar th thermal technology and can be highly efficient in providing sustainable energy for heating space and water. It is simply to construct and operate however it has some disadvantage that includes instability performance and limited efficiency. It is important to identify your needs while looking at the various type of solar collectors. Some flat plate heaters can be connected directly to the building HVAC system while other require a separate electric supply that needs to be monitored often depending on your specification. As mentioned earlier, there are many benefits associated with using a flat plate collector as an alternative source of heating water or space. But given the amount of choices available in market, it is difficult, it is difficult to make an informed decision. Thank you.